witness. Please uh, state your name and occupation. Larry Butts. Uh, womanizer. This is a colossal waste of time. Mr. Butts, please begin your testimony. You got it, Pops. Well, I was hanging out with my girlfriend, Ruth, in my mansion with the golden picket fence. Um, excuse me. Sir, must I remind you now to please tell the truth? Because perjury's a criminal offense. Whew. Uh, sorry. Let me try that again. All right. See, I was all alone because I'd just been dumped. And I know that isn't easy to believe. <laughs> I hit the lake so I could look for some junk, which had also left me on that Christmas Eve. But as I brought that boat back into the shop, I heard a gunfire with a noisy pop. And I know you don't think my opinion counts for a whole lot, but let me guarantee you that I heard that shot. That's how it all happened, I recall the clearest day, so believe it even if you think I'm nuts. This testimony's vague. And you know just what they say, when something smells. It's usually the butts. This witness is contributing nothing. I suggest he be dismissed, and ideally drawn and quartered. Hold it! Larry. There is one thing that sounds out of place in your testimony. And what's that, Nick? Well, you say you heard a gunshot. Yesterday, Miss Lotta Hart testified, and I quote, Y'all listen good now, I heard two dang gunshots that night. Um, you, you said miss and not missus, right? Larry, 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 please, stay focused. And explain why you didn't hear the second gunshot. Truth is that I was listening on my headphones, because radio's the friend that's always there. I like to jam out when I'm feeling alone So I may have missed a shot that filled the air But I remember that one thing that I heard The DJ was talking when it occurred So I know it wasn't something like a killer drum and riff But let me guarantee you that I was scared stiff When the DJ had talked there was hardly any noise So I listened in awe of her really sexy voice It was pure and demure, yes mature and so refined I can't get that lovely voice out of my mind that's how it all happened, I recall it plain as ink And to get up here, it took a while of gut Ha! This guy should see a shrink, cause his testimony stinks And when something smells, it's probably a butt I can't stand to listen to this lad This young man has nothing new to add Larry, there's just one thing I should know When you listen to the radio In regards to the DJ, what exactly did she say on that show? Do you know? I... I remember. She said, Hey, it's almost Christmas. Um, Mr. Wright, anything to add? I, um... Yeah. As compelling as your argument is, I demand that the witness end this pointless charade. Now! Oh, very well. Mr. Larry Botts, you are now dis... Objection! Your Honor, please! I just found out how this testimony changes everything. If you recall, Miss Lotta's camera went off at 12.15 December 25th. Yes, yes. And though the witness is incompetent, frankly quite a dope, I know hey. his shaky testimony's not a myth. Hey, come on, and buddy. And though we all assumed the gunfire twice, the murder weapon fired thrice. One was fired Christmas Eve, the other's Christmas Day, and these three photos illustrate my repartee. See? One, from when the camera went off at 11.50 p.m., almost Christmas. And two more at 12.15. The camera caught three snapshots for three gunshots, and Larry's testimony proves it. Why, well, you're absolutely right. Uh, no objections, Mr. Von Karma? Very well, then. The question is, what happened in this 25-minute gap? Oh, uh, indeed. Uh, we shall look into this matter further and finish the trial tomorrow. Mr. Butts, uh, any final thoughts? Well, Nick, that's quite a trick. It shocked even me. It's impressive how you managed to survive. I think that you could even get edgy green, or at worst, just in prison for life. That's how it all happened, and that's all I got to say. I recall it just like it was yesterday. And so I saved the day, even though I'm just a clown. When something, when something smells, smells it's, it's gotta, gotta be That man needs a lobotomy When something smells it's gotta, gotta be, be the butt That's right, it's gotta be the butt Ha-cha! Get him out of here!